good things to be seen. I thought your starter pitched pretty well today. Had some opportunities in offense, just couldn't cash in. We didn't grab the RBI moments today, and that was a difference. You know, I think uh, – Told the team, I think our starting pitching and our bullpen, our our stuff is going to play. There's 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 weapons in our pitching staff to to you know strike out capabilities. We have some we have some ability to strike some guys out. Uh, that game was kind of played in a couple of RBI moments that we didn't capitalize on, and then anytime we made one little mistake, Indiana followed it with a sack fly, or you know we made the mistake on the bunt play, or we walk a guy at the wrong time, base hit. So. They took advantage of mistakes today, and we didn't. You have a guy who hasn't pitched in a couple of years. He comes out there, second pitch, he gives up a bomb. After that, he was brilliant. I've never seen a guy strike out so many batters via the changeup. Yeah. You think if you, you have found a, a, certainly a, a guy that you're going to have in there on the weekends every weekend? Yeah, I think so. You know, we, we've got some battles going on for those for those three spots. We've got kind of six guys that are kind of vying for those three spots, and it's been that way uh, through the whole preseason. Uh, the three we elected to go with this weekend were the ones that kind of came out on top in those in the pecking order, and they all three pitched pretty well. You know, even Hunter on on game one was really good up until a certain until the big inning, and that's when we gave him gifts. I think the uh, total was what thirty five strikeouts mm-hmm. by your pitchers this weekend. Most of the time, you get thirty five Ks. <laughs> You're feeling pretty good about your chance to win a series. Yeah, and, and what it speaks volumes to is the depth of the Indiana lineup, where we strike out, strike out, strike out, and then one little RBI moment, a guy. Is able to move a ball for a sack fly, or you know, Shear comes in and strikes out Gorski, their preseason All American, in a big moment, and then walks a guy to get to the uh, bases loaded single situation. So it's just a couple of little mistakes that came at the wrong time, and then they follow the mistakes up with execution. Small sample size, just three games, but what did you learn about your team this weekend? You know, I think we've got we've still got some battles going on in the corner outfield spots, you know, that, that you know. Uh, I think Hunter Goodman's going to be a guy that we can mm-hmm. kind of, you know, rally around and build around a little bit. And it's tough to put that on a freshman, but he, uh, he's got some capabilities in that batter's box. Uh, Nick Vogue has jumped out and is, is barreled up and given us at least two good at bats every game, and that's good to see. We've got some veteran presence in the lineup. We got Logan Carey, a little token AB there. He probably, without the back injury, probably would have been our opening day starter in left field. We're working him in slowly now with that back and. He jumped in there and got his first hit as a Tiger. So uh, we've got some battles going on that, that, that we'll continue to play around with to get to get some sli- to solidify the lineup. I, I know the expectations are high. You've got a nice mixture of veteran players and, and young players. But give me two players that have to really produce for you guys to have success. Well, it's Trell and Olette. I mean, that's, that's, they have to go. And, and, uh, and Henneman's got to give us more leadoff type at bats, which he – he has the capability of doing. I think uh, as it goes, I think he'll settle into that more. And you know, we, you know, and he 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 was not a guy that was easy to strike out last year, and he, right. sh- he struck out what four times this weekend or five. I don't think that'll continue with Kale. He'll give us more leadoff type at bats. Uh, ben Brooks has been a good a good little find where he he's given us pretty you know some good life in his abs right now. So he's grown up a lot in one year. He was a guy that we kind of. Played down at the bottom last year and just kind of let him get his feet wet. Now we're going to ask him to do a little more, and he's he's responding. So uh, I think you know obviously Trello no letter keys for us. If they they've got to go and and uh, they because they're gonna they're gonna find RBI moments and and Kyle led us in RBIs last year. So he he he's, you know he can do it. It's just a matter of getting him on track. All right, Brock. Thanks, Thanks very much. Thanks. We'll see you.